Hi. Hi guys, Brian here. Um, just quickly before we start, I just want to give a quick apology for the audio in this. Some of it's a little messed up, but we wanted to put this video out. Uh, and we promise that things are going to get better in the future. I'm looking into better recording equipment. Uh, it just takes a little bit of time. And, well, obviously I need to get the money first. But uh, we hope you enjoy this uh, podcast either way. It was very fun to do. And we think you'll enjoy it. Please just, like I say, give us a little bit of slack for the audio. Things just went wrong. Hi everybody, uh, this is Brian the Scary Lion, joined once again by Sophie. The Unicorn. Oh, sorry, I didn't say your phone name. Sophie the Unicorn. Hi guys! Um, apologies if there's a little bit of crackle in Sophie's thing. We don't know what's happening. I'm going to try to fix it in post, but if I can't, I apologise. And just to let you know, we've we tried recording and checking it and it just isn't yeah uh, we were going to do video but unfortunately my well, camera doesn't want to work mine does yours doesn't yeah uh, um another thing um my neighbors are doing a little bit of work on the house so you may hear drilling and things throughout this i apologize this for what? that just to let you know, this is why I'm in my, my bedroom, not my living room, because over here is... The, my next door neighbours must be having a, a meltdown, because all I can hear is my next door neighbour screaming at a kid. So that's why we're in here. No matter where I go in my house, I'm going to get the drill in. Plus, I'm recording from my PC, whereas you're recording from your phone. It's kind of yeah. hard for me to move around the PC. <laughs> I don't move around with this, I'm too lazy. Uh, another thing you might have noticed, but we're trying to keep a schedule now on the main channel, and that's a video every Thursday. Um, there may be other videos posted throughout the week, but the main thing is that we get a video every Thursday. Mm, and once I get this camera, I guess who's going to be doing um, individual videos? Uh, that's one thing that we haven't mentioned either. Um, Sophie is going to be getting my old camera. Yeah, um, so, I'm going to be starting my ramp videos up again. Uh, she, and the best part about this is she's not going to have to wait for me to come over to record. Literally, it'll just be uh, me getting the footage from her so that I can edit it and everything. So, so before we get in this podcast, I'd like you in the comments to maybe put some ideas on what you want me to do individually. Um, I'd be really interested in it because, yeah. but my rant videos are coming back because I have a lot to rant about. <laughs> <laughs> and um, do you know what? Let's let's do let's do a morgues thing. What? Right, uh, everybody listening, you've got five seconds to That's like thing. to like the video. Right, uh, it started as a morgues thing. Oh. You, you've got five seconds to like the video, or else you will have to like it somewhere outside of the five seconds. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. And if you don't, you, you, you're just not doing your homework, I guess. <laughs> you, <laughs> if you don't, you're a doody head. <laughs> but yeah, um, are you ready? No, I'm five, not. Five, four, three, two, one. Like the video. And we just sold out. Yep. No. <laughs> um, but, uh, but as well, usual, um, Sophie and I have a topic for today's video, which so, we will start with, and then we will completely forget about and start talking about random shit. Yeah, so, so what's the topic? Uh, today's topic is YouTube, just YouTube in general. We're going to talk about... Ooh, um, how, are you ready for my first question towards you, then? Go on. What's the? F Do you know when you were in high school? Aye. And you saw like videos going around from YouTube. Aye. Name five. Name five videos from YouTube. Yeah, the, you're the ones that you used to see around, like people going, "Have you seen this?" All right. Well, the biggest one, the first, it was actually the first ever YouTube, like proper YouTube video that I saw that wasn't music. Mm -hmm. uh, it was Akin Fenwa is a beast. 
It's right. an old J- an old KSI video. Right. Um, what else? I Shall know... I do, do you want to do one you, then me, and then you, then me, and then you've Go got on. time to do Mine was... Badger, 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 mushroom, mushroom. Badger, 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 yeah. badger, 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 badger. Uh, I fucking love that. Um, yeah. Sticking to the same scale as that, there was narwhals. Right. Are you narwhals, ready for mine? They yeah. Are, are you narwhals. ready? Yeah, go on. Uh, chocolate. <laughs> chocolate. Chocolate rain. rain. Chocolate rain. Some stay dry while others feel the pain. Chocolate yeah. rain. Uh, I can't remember. Oh, oh, I, 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 I. There's one that I hated. You I'm know, a I, I'm a flithery little snakey snake. I don't know why everybody loves it, but I still I hate it. Um, let me think. Oh, are you ready? Go on. Snake, snake. Severus Snape. Dumbledore. Dumbledore. <laughs> so I got that out of the That's number three. Uh, number four. It's hard because back in the day, all I listened, all, all I did was listen to music on that. Um, I guess ooh. you could put that as a topic. Do you know the ones where it were just lyrics? Oh, um, actually, th- this, I don't even think Sophie knew about. Um... The first ever montage video I saw mm-hmm. was a Josh montage. Ah. A, a cod, a, a Zerka cod montage. Um, let me think. My last one. Oh, um. Oh, let me think. This is Talk while we're doing it, we're not going to have the balls. Well, um, this is your fourth. This is your fourth, no, your fifth. Yeah. Um, so you've got another two to think of. Let me think. Uh, the um, I liked all those. Like, have you noticed it's all the small ones? So mine would mm. be like. Uh, oh, um, no. Uh, e R. E R O R E R O. Oh, do you know the Gangster's Paradise? The one with the Amish one. Oh, right. Aye, uh, aye. Uh, you know what I mean? The Amish Paradise? Aye. Uh, I liked all that. Like, do you know all the different, uh, what, what are they called? Parodies? Yeah, I love the parody ones. Like, they were... The Key of Awesome? Yeah, like, stuff like that. Jesus, that Key, of awesome. Key of Awesome, that's gone back. The Key of Awesome. Mm. Um, right, the final one for me, uh, it was a simple one. It was just somebody kicking a ball into somebody's balls. Are you ready? I did a YouTube video back in the day. I can't find it. Let's... And it was me. It, are you ready? Go on. It was me singing. Do you, do you know Buffy the Vampire Slayer, the musical of it? Aye. It was... Bunnies aren't as cute as everybody, so but it was really cringy. <laughs> I had really short hair. It was like one video, so how everyone was posting one video on YouTube. Uh, uh, with my little sister, I was heavily pregnant. <laughs> um, but like that's up there somewhere. So I guess I'm gonna put that in there because it was my first experience of recording the video. I guess. Oh, try not to hit the mic. I didn't hit the mic. Oh, there was a big thud on the mic. That wasn't me. But, um, I, uh, speaking of that, I'm staying away from videos about me since before the channel. There's a video that's no longer on YouTube, but it was me sat crying my eyes out. Are you kidding me? I found out my Liam's got videos up on YouTube. <laughs> no, I think what... everyone, but everyone of our era have uh, like one video or, or made a video or made lyrics or made something that goes on the internet. So, uh, like, it, I've realised that YouTube, when it first came out, it was just about expressing yourself, like, putting something you really love about, like, you know, just something random. Ah, well, the old uh, YouTube 
Uh, it literally used to be on the logo. It's not there anymore, which sucks. But it used to be YouTube broadcast yourself. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's gone now. It's just it just says YouTube. It, I, yeah, but what's really funny is people have took that to a whole new level, and people are broadcasting stuff that they really shouldn't have out there. Aye. I think that I think that's the biggest drawback that's ever came with YouTube: the fact that you can upload anything. Did you know? I'm watching the Jacksepticeye video, right? Right. I love Jacksepticeye. He's my kind of. I like shouty videos. Um, and there was a guy that it was really eerie. Mm. And um, is it what's it called? What's what's the language? The sign language is it? And um, the. Uh, uh, no, the ALS is that. But um, he was doing like the sign language and he was telling people that uh, because something was going on with the graveyard, he got his grandma and brought it back and she stayed in his yard. And then there's, he opens the casket and you see this decomposed grandma oh, and he starts, no. wait, it gets worse and he, he starts kissing it. Ah, grim. Yeah, that's on YouTube. Um, well, I, I had a little idea for a little part in this video. Well, we might as well do that. As YouTubers and that. I won't call us YouTubers. <laughs> no, I'm not talking about us, really. I'm talking oh, about right, in yeah. general. Uh, right. A lot of people talk about the problems with YouTube. Right. right? So I thought for a nice little segment in this, let's let's sit and talk about some of the really good wait, things wait, wait. that YouTube's I brought. Do, I'm going to make a little sound. Do, 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 do. What has YouTube brought us good? That was awful. <laughs> that was Cringe. awful. Cringe. <laughs> but let's let's talk about some of the best parts of YouTube. I think the best. Are, be- we, are think- we talking about while we're doing it or not? We can talk about any um, aspect. YouTube got Josh Zerka saying my name, which was like a dream come true, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. I actually fangirled over that. Well, I'd say that the biggest, the biggest positive, obviously, is the fact that you don't have to be a celebrity or anything like that to get in front of your camera, do your thing, and have loads of people see it. Do you not know what it's done for me, honestly? Go on. As someone who, oh, uh, as someone who generally is slow at learning the normal way, mm. using YouTube has actually given me a different way of learning. Yeah. Um, you can find all the information you need. At, like, there's there's actual like sites where it, it teaches you skills on YouTube. Aye, aye, there's absolutely um, loads of them. I've learned cooking through YouTube. Right, I'm not that I couldn't cook, but like different recipes through aye. YouTube. One of my favourite channels is um, the Sorted channel, and it's just a cooking channel. Oh, I like that, um, what's it called? Uh, cooking with Babish, I think it is. Yeah. Where it creates, well. it creates meals based on... Things from TV shows and cartoons and that, is and, and he improves them, and yeah. But this is what I mean, and not just that. Um, it helps with my anxiety saying that. Do you know when I'm not feeling like myself, I'll always like find something I really enjoy and just watch it, and it it, it makes you forget that you're anxious. So that's good. Also, hmm. you can't get in trouble for what you laugh at because it's on the YouTube. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> um, like, yeah. I'd, 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 if we're going off the personal, I'd say the biggest thing personally for me uh, is something that you pointed out at, like a little while into me doing this. Uh, I've become a lot more confident since. I agree with that. Yeah, no, you are. And that that's weird for someone like me because um. <laughs> my whole life, I've not really had the confidence today. My own thing and that, and this is me branching out and actually taking a fucking risk. What's um another thing I use YouTube for is watching playthroughs or people playing it, and then I'm like, I want that game now. It gives me a chance to look at games and then 
decide if it's worth the money and what I'm spending on. The last time that happened was um, a game called, it's in beta, mm. and it's um, Surviving the Aftermath. And I was watching people, I was like, that's the kind of game I want to play, so I got it. Uh, it's really good for that when you don't know if you want something so you can find it on YouTube, see how it is, and then get it. Instead of wasting money and being like, wait, this isn't what I wanted. Yeah. Well, I've, um, I've got a bit of a negative one here, but it's no negative towards YouTube. Yeah, go on. Um, music. Right. A big thing with this, that it annoys me that so many people like claiming that because... Yeah. Um, Simon Minter, right? Yeah. If it wasn't for his old outro, I would have never known the song uh, Famous for Assholes. Yeah. Uh, and Toby. Toby is the biggest example. The AJR song, I'm Ready. Yeah. I would never, ever have known that song if it wasn't used for his outro. Yeah, but didn't he get thinking it? I, I ended up. It ended up getting claimed. It wasn't by the artists because he yeah. already had a verbal agreement with the artists. It was by the actual music company, yeah. and it pisses me off because essentially it's free pub- publicity. Your songs getting out there. I've got, I've got both of those songs on my Spotify playlist now, and it's all because I had them for the very first time through these channels. For the very first time, sorry. Don't get me wrong, I'm not saying that, like, uh, you shouldn't be claiming one that's just straight up using your full song, not adding anything to it, not, like, changing it up in any way. That's that's the definition of copyright infringement, just completely yeah. taking a song. But if you're using a little clip from the song or, and things like that, you're essentially gone, here's a good song, go and check it out for yourself. Yeah, they usually do that. Hmm. So, uh, it's just... You know, one of the worst things that's ever come from from YouTube? Mm-hmm. I can't believe I'm saying this, but, like, the drama. Not drama as in YouTube drama, but when real life comes real into Real life it. drama comes in, yeah. Right. My example of this is, do you know, with the other tunges? Aye, with JJ and Deji. Yeah, um, oh. it's sad that that had to be put into, onto the internet and I think that's one thing I we, me and you have made a decision we have a discussion on what can and can't be put on mm. um, it's like we've had to cut footage because it's like right we know what we shouldn't be putting up there it's not just that uh, I don't know if you noticed in some videos people uh, there's a blur picture there's like some blur in the background that's a picture of my son that I've got on, in my house I I always block out images of your son. Yeah, and that's just it's not even it's it's uh, common sense really because mm. you never know who's watching. And when people, I don't get these people that put their lives out there. I don't I don't mind if I put my life out there. Like certain parts of it, I always keep off. Yeah, but but do you get where I'm coming from? Like these people that. 100% of their lives are on blogs and Aye. blogs and podcasts. And there's certain stuff I will refuse to talk about, point blank. That's for other people. Like, we never, if we're saying names, I get permission. Like, I mentioned my friend Amanda, right? Mm. I didn't give her last name. I just turned around and said her name, but I made sure I got permission off the person. Uh, it's the same whenever I do like a Q&A or anything. I'll always put on the end of my post. Uh, if you'd like your name blurred out or anything, yeah. let me know. Or we ask the person, especially if it's... I don't put it... it, it... Like I've, I think I've left in like Stephen's name in that in the past, but that's because I know Stephen uh, enjoys seeing his name pop up. Like, and same, same with Liam. Like, and... Yeah, you just don't. It's just the way it goes. Ah, uh, because I know a while ago Stephen wanted to be in one of the videos, but it's like if I was to bring Stephen in, I'd have to try to find the right sort of video from a day with us. 
It's kind of <laughs> difficult. Uh, I never want to be that guy who says, sorry, like, I can't bring you on on a video, but... Hey, can you, uh, do you want to know a good example of this? Mm. Me and you've been talking about putting my Liam in a video for a long time. No, it's been a while now, and I'm like, no. Uh, I was going to say, let's be honest about it. He's ready to do it. Yeah, he wants to. Like, I'm okay with I, him doing it, but so he said no. No, <laughs> no, and I have reasons for that, and it's because Liam is my private life, and it's a kind of private life that's different to talking about us because we're on the platform but I don't want to like some of the ideas we want we want to do a who knows Sophie best Aye. Uh, because it'll be funny and my ex like an ex and my current and we want to do who's most likely to you and uh, see, uh, see that's a yeah. big thing do you know because of the fact that me and uh, Liam actually get on yeah there's so many X videos we can do together that it'd be fucking hilarious. It'd be awkward and it'd be awkward and embarrassing. And me, I said, because I did genuinely say, didn't I? After a year we've been together, hmm. uh, we, we could. And I might have to have that discussion with Liam. We may do that, but it's at my discretion. By the way... By the way, don't like take it the wrong way. We're not saying we're bringing anybody new into the channel. Like no. these will be odd videos. Like the way Scary Lion and Co's set up now is the way we're going ahead in the future. Only one person might get added, maybe. But it's like we've got a nice little group at the minute. Yeah, it's not just that though. It's we made deals. We made we made. Not like deals as in we haven't rock sit out and made a contract, but it's more like we made deals um in verbal and we we have um what's the word? Uh, respect for that deals. Yeah. And we, if we do add someone we generally are gonna have a discussion about it or um, But how about we talk about not what's good, what's bad. How about how other people like the media seem to think of YouTubers as not real media people, if that makes sense. Aye, see, there's, there's certain media outlets <clears throat> that actually gave you YouTube as a media platform, which, uh, that's great, but there's a lot that see YouTube as just some silly little kids doing some silly little things on the internet, and it's like, maybe that's how it was when it started, I mean, uh, there are some silly little people doing silly little stupid things on the internet. We're not oh, saying there isn't. Of course there are. But um, I find myself a lot going to, like, Philip DeFranco and things like that to get my news. Yeah, because he doesn't actually... He's not biased. He actually... Give, well, he tries not to be. Mm. Or what he'll do is he'll give the unbiased stuff and then he'll give his opinion. Hey, uh, there's, like... It's, it's refreshing to have a guy, like... It's just sat in a room, like, there's no news studio or anything, there's no, like, dun-dun-dun-dun-dun, and all that. It, it's literally a guy sat in front of your computer. And it's not in your face, either. Aye. Like, that's the reason that this is more of a media outlet nowadays, because there isn't just funny videos and things. There is serious topics being discussed. There that's is... Do you know, with this, um, this pandemic at the moment, I don't like the news because of my anxiety. I get a bit. I get. Uh, what's the word? Uh, what's it called where you think you've got every single illness? Oh, uh, I'm oh, a hypochondriac. Yeah, hypochondriac. I'm, I'm sometimes, sometimes I'm not saying all the time. Sometimes I'm a hypochondriac. So mm. going on the news isn't good for me because I think the world's ending, right? So instead of that, I'll go and find the information looking at professionals and doctors and all that, and I can find that on YouTube. Mm. And I don't just look for one, I look up about five sources. Yeah. But on news, they just give the source that they choose to use that day. Yeah. But it's not just that. How can they say we're just silly YouTubers now? Because look what KSI's been to the... Um, for the full plot. KSI's is very good. Do you know what? I respect him. He's doing music. He's, uh, he's, he was supposed to do festivals. He's doing, uh, he was on Top Gear, for God's sake. 
Ah, uh, there's certain things, there's certain ways you can look at JJ and go, right, this guy's a complete dick. We, we, right, I'm a fan of JJ, but I'm not going to be blind. There's certain ways you can look at it and go, man, this guy seems like a complete dick. But, um, you see everything that he's done. He has really innovated what being a YouTuber is. And, oh, oh, on, I agree. and on top of that, um, anybody you hear from says that the guy is actually humble. Like, what you see on screen's more of just a character. Apparently the guy's pretty humble in real life. Well, actually, from what, what I've seen on this video, there's two characters. There's the one that he plays, and then there's the... Do you know why like, I'm ready when he does Reddit videos? Aye. That's him. <coughs> it, he's but, the perfect way to describe a YouTuber. He is both JJ and KSI. Actually, he's, his fans are very upset because he's not KSI anymore. And guess what? He's changed his name to JJ. Is he? But I think that's because of his professional career that's going around as well. He wants to be seen as JJ now. Aye. Well, that, Which is fair. He's not fair. quite... He's come a long way in his career. He's not the same guy who was making FIFA funnies. Do you mean the virgin little shy gamer boy that, Aye. that did Hesky Time? Aye. Because the young girl, I've literally just downloaded his new album. Ah, oh, fair enough. And I don't what, like his new what, music. No, but I'm saying what music, what YouTuber can say they've had a, um, a song in the top ten? What YouTuber can say that they've had a song in the top ten, been a sports personality, uh, been a YouTuber, been in movies, like JJ's... Been in Top Gear? Uh, JJ's like I said, fully, Top Gear? JJ's fully expanded <laughs> what it is to be a YouTuber and props to him for it. No, what's funny, you don't see much JJ merch, though. That's the one thing he doesn't need to do because he's got everything else. No, th right, there's a lot of JJ merch, but it's more like... It doesn't need to. It doesn't need to advertise it all the time. No, this is another thing, right? About YouTubers now, there's merch, and there is. Mm -hmm. But then there's the ones that are making clothing lines. There's a big difference. It is merch is for your channel, and then the clothing lines are just. You mean like uh, ZRK like, and um, Vision. Uh, vision Ill and yeah. Ill vision and what what's that one that uh, Jack started with uh, Mark Jack Sepps guy started with Mark Markiplier. I don't know, but like all oh, the ones with mental health. Yeah, I can't I can't remember what but, it was called. But, but like the 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 YouTube's helping people get what they want. Yeah, like become like you. Right, you what when you before you did this, and this is a really good example, and we've talked about this before. You wanted to do films, or media. Uh, or I that. wanted to be an actor. And you, you come in, um, not not Ben's, but it's not like you have the opportunities to do that where we are. Mm. So this is just another way uh, example of. Do you know what I wanted, and I'm getting it from YouTube. Go on. That confidence to. Talk. Aye. People might think from this YouTube channel, I am, I will never shut up and all that. Truth is, if it's not with Brian and it's not with my Liam, I am quite a quiet person. Yeah. I struggle with the social, uh, social situations. Yes, and social, like, yeah, uh, and words, as you can tell. But coming to YouTube, I've actually become very confident. I've learned to. I've learned that my opinion is no less than others. I'm mm. not saying it's better, I'm not saying it's worse, I'm not saying, but it's not the law. It's also got my, me a chance to actually be, start thinking about what I believe and been, when it comes to feminism, when it comes to all that. And it's because I've had the chance to grow with the people that listen, and you guys, and with Brian. And it's actually brought me and Brian very close yeah. as friends. Um, we haven't argued once over YouTube yet. I'm still uh, waiting for it. <laughs> no, because 
thankfully we didn't become friends because of YouTube. We became friends. We were friends and then we became YouTube. You know what I mean? Aye. I think the ones that argue were the ones that did it through YouTube. Aye. See, um, one of the biggest things that uh, I feel like could have, if I didn't like see it in a different way, um, basically, I'm the one that started this channel and I did the editing and that, but I try not to, I try not to make it my channel. If you get me. Oh, look, one of the best things you've ever done for me is say put more pressure on me to do videos because I. My moods can change through my anxiety and depression, which thankfully is getting better. And we're gonna, I'm giving myself a round of applause. But, um, you've never put the pressure on us. Even though it is now, uh, it's our channel, I guess. Oh. I, I hope it is. Um, we, we have never been put under pressure to, Perform, I guess. That sounds like some a porn star would say. No, but um, I think people know what you mean. Um, something. Yeah, we've never been. He's always, and you know what? The one thing Brown's always said is, if I ever wanted to do my own channel, I, I can. I, I, I don't I, want I, to. I'd I, never, I'd never upload. <laughs> I'd help <laughs> you set. I'd help you set up and everything. And if you yeah. turned around and went, do you know what? I don't want to do the scary line and co channel anymore. I'd be like, okay, fair enough. I probably, do you know, do you want to know the truth? I probably would do stuff on my channel, but then still be on not yours. No. Like certain stuff that I just think, yeah, that is for my channel, and then there'd be stuff that I'd be like, yeah, that's definitely brain and core kind of stuff. See, here, here's uh, one thing, right? You've done this, you've done it before, where you've said the good stuff like about me, and I, I try not to jump in. I try not to be like, you don't need to say all this. So, for once, I want to do something here. Okay. I want to talk about the others on the channel. Um, what, all of us? Every Aye. So it's my turn to gush a lot. Have you noticed? He hasn't said me, it was the other people. He doesn't gush about me, but he'll go. I'm joking. I'm joking, guys. Funny cunt. Uh, um... YouTube drama! YouTube drama! <laughs> Uh, Brian, Brian the Scare Lion exposed. Ah. Yeah. Well, <laughs> no. Um, who are we starting with? Who are we starting with? I'm going to start with you, obviously. No, 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 no. We'll do me last because I'm the best. Let's go to Tom because he lives with you as well, which is very interesting. See, with Tom, um, we've always been close. Mm, um, I'm very, I'm actually very close to Tom, and that's very strange. Because Tom doesn't like anyone. <laughs> but um, for a while, like, we, we've been, obviously he's been living with me and that. And yeah. we, we tend to spend all of our time in separate rooms doing we're thing. Um, but I, when we come together, we talk about these video ideas and we have so much fun with it. And Tom's got a great insight into the, a lot of these videos as well. So it, it's, I'm really happy that I'm able to work work on these with my brother who sorry to say it Sophie is one of my best friends it's no 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 do no, no, what's really can I give something about Tom go on the thing about Tom for me is me and him when we're sat together it's like having two best friends like when we're in the same videos, like, do you remember the Brian's, uh, Brian's birthday one? Aye. Um, we did, um, me and Tom were the main subjects of that. And me and him had the best chemistry because we just don't care. Me and him are not act like we're on video. We act like we would when we're sat together. Or when we did the, we're at the 100 video, 100 subscribers one. Me and Tom were on here as well. Do you know but, that's, that's in the top 10 uh, most watched videos on the channel. No, but this is what I'm saying. Like, me and Tom, like, we understand why you and Tom are big good. Like, brothers and just that chemistry. But to say that I am, I don't live there anymore. Yeah. Uh, uh, that when me and Brian were together, me and Tom didn't really get along as well as it was should have. That's Aye. just facts. Uh, but now me and Tom have the best chemistry, and it, 
it's because we have the same kind of humour as well. We're very dark and we're, we don't really censor ourselves and, you know. So I want to give credit to Tom just actually putting yourself forward and being Tom in yeah. the videos. Because most of them, I have a sort of persona, no, mine's more an exaggeration of myself. Hmm. Yours is like what you want to be, yeah? Aye. And then Tom's just Tom. Aye, uh, Tom, l literally what you see from Tom, that's Tom. He doesn't change himself to be in front of the camera. I, if you see, I tweak. If you, what's funny is sometimes you see Tom just not bothered about the video, and I think that's brilliant. I love that in the video. <laughs> when and, he's just uh, sat there straight face like, uh, can this be yeah. over yet? But that's just Tom, and we don't want, I wouldn't want Tom changing, that's just turned out to Tom all over. Yeah. Ah! That's for you, Tom! <laughs> um, are you ready? Right, uh, we've got the unofficial member of the Scare Line and Co. I won't call him, which one are we talking about here? Ian. Oh, I thought we were talking about that. Ian is the, the... How do I put this? Ian's going to kill me. He's the one the the boy of the group. Pretty much. He, 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 he's the one that always argues with us all. <laughs> in a good way, like, even in videos, he's like, no, yes, okay. And I love it because that's, that's another part of what makes this group. He, he emphasises what's very good about this group and that's we're all different. Aye, like, le legit, Ian, Ian, Ian can make a boring video seem funny just because he's fucking, it's his, he's, it's his arguments, his arguments against anything. You will argue, uh, you will argue that air is not air, it is bubblegum if he, he wants to cut it, just because it's an argument. Aye, he, he could literally put a banana in front of you, say that's an apple. And then argue for the next fucking three hours about how this, but how this like banana or orange or whatever is an apple. But it's not even in a bad way. Like me and like I said again, me and Ian get along very well. I'm not even one of them, right? Uh, um, but also, it's having an outside where he is a YouTuber. He's a, like he's not like he doesn't do the editing. He doesn't really do any of it and still be able to come in and act like one. Aye. Uh, I think the reason that we have so much chemistry is like Ian 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 for me has yeah. he's he's always been there. Like it's weird, no matter where we've gone in that <laughs> Ian's always been there. Yeah. And so it's like I I no matter where I go, I've always got Ian. Yeah, are you ready for Liam? Liam, this one's oh. going to be a big one, especially when it comes to YouTube. If you're ready for Liam, I think our edits would be there. Uh, like... No, no, I'm going to say this. It's not that our edits were bad, it's you wouldn't be so varied. Uh, no, uh, like, he, he took a course and then all this, so he's actually really good at it, like, I, I'm, what you see from my edits, that's me working off a no knowledge or anything, I, no I kind of to build myself. Uh, yeah, no offence to the rest of you, he is the funniest out, a lot of us, I think. Oh, that's right. But, um, he, he's a, a chameleon, he can work well with different people, but I'll, I'll, I can't wait. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm going to say this, I'm sending it to Brian all the time. I can't wait till me and Liam go with you. Right, that's going to be the most popular video on this channel when you and Liam get together Clash. in the video. Clash! Uh, basically. Um, but um, he's the kind of guy that we can... He's very chilled as well. To, he, he will go, yeah, I'm up for it. And he'll be, he will do anything because... He know, and then he'll say, well, how are we going to edit this? He'll look at it from a different perspective because he's an editor. Do you know what I mean? He, he, has, he has a different point of view, and I love that. And not just that, I want to do this again, and it's going to come off YouTube. Because we haven't talked about Ian, Ian and Tom. Aye. A lot. We'll do this after this. 
Well, well here's one of the biggest things. Um, like Liam and Ian uh, had the ch- had a channel before all this. Yeah. Uh, the Outcasts. Go and check it out. The videos are still up, and they're actually they're actually pretty funny. Um, but when I first started, all I was thinking about was recording, getting a video out there. Liam helps me with everything that I needed. He helped me set up my YouTube page. He helped me know what I'm doing when I'm uploading. Uh, say like get thumbnails and shit. Did, like that. Wait, didn't he? Didn't he direct you to the YouTube community? Aye, like Liam has. Not a lot of people know this. Liam has been very instrumental in building this channel. And before even I turn up. And I, I, I'm, I, I'll be forever grateful for that. Like back, back when uh, I was doing my old videos, this was like <laughs> my old old videos, the the thumbnails and everything are cringy. But back then, he was offering to help with editing videos and that. But uh, I was too proud. Proud to know the word uh, independent. I wanted to do everything myself. That's proud. <laughs> okay. Do you want to hear some? Do you want to hear something about that? I don't think anyone knows except me and you. Go on. When I first did my videos, my first videos, I... we've lost you, Sophie. Unfortunately, we've lost Sophie for the time being. She'll be back. Are you back? I don't know what happened, I'm sorry. Oh no, it's alright, like, uh, I filled in the time. Um, I was just saying, like, I, I could gush about Ian for, uh, I could gush about, I, I could gush about Liam for ages, because... Oh, right, I, I can say what I was going to say then. Go That's on. so unprofessional of me, I'm sorry guys. <laughs> um, the, when we first, when I first started doing videos, I literally turned around and I felt really bad, but I turned around and can Liam edit my videos, please. And I, I went like that. Uh, uh, it's it's because he's got the knowledge yet, and he's he's like so good. Go back and check out the uh, fear pong video. Like that's Liam's work. Not just that. Look at the, you know um, my my second no the you know the one where we just picked up hits. Aye. For me, and we we if we want. Sorry, but simple editing. I'll always want to Brian because he can. He's simple editing. Yeah, he's f- for now I'm amazing. getting better. <laughs> yeah, but when it comes to stuff like where we do want things inserting, and things really changing, we go to Liam because he has the knowledge. He's got the power. He has uh, the power. Um, but not saying that the rest of them like. I, I don't know what I bring to this table. I'm not even pretending like. I, oh, you bring so, a lot. Like, trust no, me. Wait, wait, wait. But I will, what I'm going to say is, I am nothing without these lot. And that's the truth because I make simple videos, usually. Uh, but it's these lot that make my videos look good and make sense. Because a lot of the time it's, oh, no, I've done it wrong. And, so, I'm going to say it now, um, and this is something that I've never said, I don't think m- my channel would still be gone if it wasn't for having you guys in it. Yeah. I started getting bored of recording videos on my end, and when I record with you, when I record with Liam, when I record with Tom or Ian, like I have so much fun recording. And this is why, I'm, I'm going to give you all uh, a sneaky peek. We, after all this stuff was finished, we have plans. Aye, we, we, we will not go because, in yet. No, what I'm, I'm all I'm going to say is I've had many people go, I've loved to see the chemistry between you all. Aye. This is the best bit. So we're going to make it, and we want, uh, when we meet up, we're all going to go out. We're going on the piss, and we're thinking of locking for the first time all together. But... This is a little bit of an announcement, a little bit of a sad announcement. Ian no longer wants to be in front of the camera. 
That's fair enough. I, uh, like, I, I, I've said it since the start. If anybody doesn't feel comfortable, if anybody wants to stop doing it, it's completely fine. Like, I hold no grudges and I'm <laughs> thankful for everything that he's done. That's not to say that he's leaving. Uh, he still really? wants to be part of it. He still wants to do, like, videos like this where we're just doing a podcast. Or they, or he wants to do, like, camera work and things like that. Well, it's not the fact that I always mean, I keep making, like, jokes to myself that if I ever left, I'm making big video all about it. I'm uh-huh. making video all going, I'm sorry! Why I but, left BuzzFeed. Yeah, that kind of thing. <laughs> Why I left Brian and Paul and it being a big thing. But that's because I'm, I don't, I don't know if I have the right to this, but I feel like I'm, I am Brian and Paul with you. <laughs> I'm, I am cool, and um, that's not me being big-headed, that's not me saying I'm a big part, but I've got how many videos now? Uh, a lot, a lot, a lot. That's what I mean, and, um, but at the same time, you said that I won't get to do a video with you, that's just the way it goes. Yeah. Um, but... On the plus note, we'll always have Ian to help us make ideas and decisions. I mean, still, obviously, it's still my friend, so he's still going to be around. We get to see him. It's just a shame you don't. See, something you just said, I, I, I didn't even think, think it like that. Uh, Tom, Ian, Liam, let me know how yours feel. Uh, it, it, is that a thing? Like, you fully feel like you're the whole and co thing? I do. If it is, that's pretty cool. No, like I'm, I'm not having a go at it or anything. I've just never thought of it like that. Well, what did you think Ancor? I know what Ancor means, and we've lost you again, Sophie. Uh, she'll be back again in another moment. Uh, so we'll just cut to that. Hello. Hey, love. I'm sorry. We don't know what's going on today. I think it's my signal. Yeah, it's, it's alright. It, shit like this happens. No, um, when I thought about the Anko stuff, like, it was like, that was a name, if you get me. Like, we're all us, but like, the whole Anko thing was just a name. I didn't think it'd have, like, an impact. Do you want to hear something really funny? I was really nervous about doing this podcast today. Don't know why. And William Mitchell went, Come on, you can do it. You're a lion. I went, no, I'm not. I'm a unicorn. <laughs> like, but I was thinking about this. We are. We're the anchor. And it's, I'm not saying you're the, I, I never boost you go and say you're the main. Yeah. But you did darkness. You're the, you're the founder. We're just the ones that followed along. I feel like we've gone past that now. You're our boss. And you're horrible. Uh... <laughs> I don't like hearing that. Like, the horrible stuff. Like, you can call me horrible and all that all the time. Please don't call me your boss. You are. You're kind of my... How about this? You're not my boss. You're my leader. Still sounds Um, weird to me. I don't want to be a boss. (laughs) I don't want to be a leader. How long has this been going on for? This podcast? Uh, Probably about 40 minutes. Something like that. Well, there's someone you haven't talked about yet. I think I deserve. I am part of Anchor. So, here we go. Talking about about Sophie. How about I do what I think first? Ah, big yourself up, is it? No, no, no. The one (laughs) thing I do think is, when you you were doing it on your own, I was the person who rang you up and were like, you should do this. Uh, Sophie's always had a lot of input. Um, One of the biggest things that Sophie's done as well... Um, you might have noticed I'm pretty, pretty shit when it comes to promoting. Like, I'm very bad at it, but Sophie has a way of getting these videos around, telling people about them, talking, uh, even in like, little games and that, you always... I brag! Yeah, exactly, <laughs> you brag about these, and it gets it gets views. Mm, it's not even views I'm after. I like asking, I find out opinions of people. Um, I, well, I go directly to people who watched it and say, what do you like and what do you not like? And then I go back to Brian, who's like, 
you know, we get we use them. But at the same time, right, that's all. I, I've told Brian, and this is a secret that I thought I'd keep to the grave, but this is a very good... Oh, are you ready? Hmm. I told Brian I didn't feel like I was part of it. If I left, it wouldn't be important. And Brian, thankfully, turned around and went, no, that's not true. You, you've you brought a lot to it. I'm not asking you to brag for me. I don't actually want that. Please don't. But he made this whole thing, they've all made me very thankful to be in it. And I think that's the main part of this. That we are a very support. We I don't know how people ask it because they say friends shouldn't work together and all that, and it is work. Um, yeah, I mean, it can come down to work at times. But it's because it's also because we are friends that we are able to do this for so long. Yeah. No, um, uh, it's like before you were saying about how you use a lot of the core. Um, at this point, I feel like. We're all scary lion and co because each of us fit this little piece that if that piece was taken away, it'd change it a whole lot. I the whole landscape of the channel would change. So I feel like everybody brings in that little piece, and this is me it's officially not- saying it. Now that we've gone for everybody, this is me officially saying it. I want to thank each of properly. I'd like to say thank you to you as well, sweetie. Thank you. This is very soppy. Can we just say we're all arseholes at the same time? We, Aye, all we are. Habits. We are. We're all arseholes at I, the same time. I think we are going to have to do that. But some, I think we should all be in one podcast and we talk about, maybe have like work counselling on podcasts. That'd be fantastic. How about, um, we just do, how about we just do like a side men roast thing where we all just roast each other? Well, not even roast. <laughs> Maybe just say what the back points of us all are. We give, we give our permission to do that, and then yeah. But I think this is where we end it because we will spiral out. Uh, we've actually stuck to YouTube. Which Aye, I'm, very, actually... I'm impressed. We I'm, kept the I'm, topic. To say that I kept on leading the chat, and yeah. Um, apart from that, this has been a really good podcast. I've really enjoyed this one. I've had fun with this one as well. It's. I'm not, I'm not going to lie, I've wanted to find a way to say thank you to all you, and this has actually given me the opportunity to do it. Uh, um, I hope that you all um, have enjoyed this one. This one actually had a bit of substance to it, not just chit-chat. Yeah. Uh, if you'd like to hear another one, or maybe give us a topic to talk about, leave it in the comments, please. Um, John, would you like me to outro? Well, usually when we're out throwing, uh, I'd go, is there anything you'd like to say? I would like to say, please, but fuck that like button if you liked it. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. I'd really like to get, have we got to 500 yet? No, we're on 478, I believe. We'd really like to get to 500, but if I, how about we make a deal? Mm-hmm. If we get to 500, you'll shave your hair. No, oh, get get fucked. <laughs> we, we'll we, wax them out. We'll we've do done punishment. this before. We said, if how we... about this? If we get to 500, we will do fear pong again, but with all of us. Yeah, aye, aye. If we get to 500, I, I'm willing to say that. I, I don't mind it because I like doing the their sorts of videos anyway. Yeah, and I I don't, so that'll be even better. <laughs> um, and then, um, and I want to say thank you for Brian for doing this. And thank you to you guys for listening, and I hope you all have a great week. Uh, Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye.